We are exploring a river in northern Scotland. This film is about the lower course. Here I am drawing a diagram of a typical river in the British Isles. It looks a bit like a tree. I have seven key terms to label. Drainage basin, watershed, source, tributary, confluence, floodplain and mouth. Here I am sketching the River Nairn. It has a long, thin drainage basin stretching southwest from the mouth. The river long profile looks something like this. In parts two and three, we saw how the river changed downstream. The floodplain changes, it has more fertile grazing downstream. This is from the gate beside the road looking down towards the river. Watch this football. Are the contour lines here close together or far apart? Here it is, look. I think the middle course runs from Aberada as far as Kilrourke. Downstream of Kilrourke, the floodplain is wider and the soil more fertile, fertile enough for crops. The river flows to the north of Corda village and continues in a northeast direction to the mouth at Nairn. Here I am standing at about 55 metres above sea level. This crop is barley. You can tell by the pointy hairs around the ears. See if you can tell where I am standing on the map in these next few shots. Pause and watch it again if you want. Answer at Newton of Budgate. Just here. Here are fields of wheat. The river runs behind the line of trees in the background. What do you think this is? It's marked here on the map. Here is a ford. Before bridges were built, rivers were crossed either by a ford or ferry. You'd get ferries on big rivers like the Thames. Here I am checking the depth of the water. I am wading through the deepest part. This section is more shallow. This is how high the river is. It'll be up to about here. It should be well over the doors. For this, you're going to need four wheel drive. I reversed because the deepest section of the river might flood the engine and we'd be stuck. The deepest section is where the water flows fastest. What happens to boulders and rocks in this fast flowing water? They get scraped 
scratched, rolled and bounced along making them smooth. Some of these rocks are as large as a rugby ball. On this map the ford is marked FB stands for footbridge. Big land that, would that go? 